if we go back five years ago and, uh, and see where we are and where we are today, I can say that uh, uh, we are very happy with whatever we have achieved. And uh, uh, this success or whatever you have seen what, it's a, is a plan uh, phase of growth. We uh, had a lot of meetings, uh, a lot of, uh, of discussions, uh, not at the management level, but at, at the board level. Uh, for us, uh, when we talk about success, the success is not just at the management team. Our success really is the relationship between us and the board. Uh, we had two sessions with the board uh, to discuss and all to plan for our strategies and the vision. And uh, that vision was approved five years ago, four years ago. And for us, it was uh, how we effectively implement that. Uh, today, I can say that uh, we are almost there, completing our first phase of growth, and we are looking forward for the next uh, phase of our growth. So our plans now is really uh, to look uh, our investments uh, and operation beyond Oman. Uh, uh, we, we always do this very careful. Uh, we are looking at different markets, uh, at a different business vertical, and uh, uh, we are we have been traveling a lot, our team have been in different markets to make sure that uh, we do thorough analysis and assessment before we start investing on those markets. The vision uh, and the strategy uh, was there before even I joined. Uh, the, the board and the chairman, they had a very clear uh, understanding between themselves that where they want to see this company uh, going forward. Uh, and when I was approached, that it was very clear for me uh, that uh, the, the board are very ambitious. Uh, they want to take Omniverse to the next level. And that, that vision was very clear communicated to me and to my team. That this is a way how we want to see the company five years from today. And uh, I'm happy to say that uh, uh, we have not disappointed uh, our, our board. Uh, we are there. Uh, we are almost fulfilling the, our first phase of growth and we are looking forward to the next uh, level of growth. Uh, our plan for the second uh, phase of growth is really to have more broader diversification, uh, not in terms of uh, business vertical, but also geographical. Uh, we are looking at the market where we think we, are, we have competitive advantage. We think that uh, our companies or ourselves, we can add value to our shareholders. Uh, for the now, for the time being, we are doing most of assessments. We are looking we, to partner with other uh, business houses or other company to create business uh, opportunity in those markets. The changes were uh, what Ominvest has taken that we have seen all this growth. It started from the board. Uh, it's really, uh, which I talked at the beginning, there's a vision, also recruiting uh, the right people, and also willing to empower the people to implement what they want them to, to implement. And that has become much easier for me to follow on and, and, and uh, uh, sit down and recruit the right people at the right position. Uh, our job in the beginning was really to have a very strong uh, foundation. And that foundation is come up on our investment philosophy, uh, come up with, uh, with the right uh, organization structure, right organization, uh, business model, uh, uh, coming up with the right risk framework, uh, and that's all been supported by the board. Uh, I think those changes help us a lot uh, in terms of uh, implementing our strategy. Uh, we have very clear segregation of the duty between board of directors and the management, but also at the management within the control support and a business area. Uh, but also having the right people uh, at the right time and the right position, I think that has been a key uh, success for us. Uh, the other success factor for us is really uh, when we start investing, we start investing at the very uh, depressed valuations. I think we are lucky uh, to be able to acquire our large investments at a discount which is, was not so before the, 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 the crisis or before where the market was before. Yeah. I think challenges will be there, whether you have a, a strong economy or you have 
sluggish economy. Uh, when you have an economy where now where the oil price is low, you have different challenges. Uh, when economy is doing very well, then you have other different challenges. For us, is really is how we assess those challenges, coming up with a clear business strategy, You're coming out with a clear risk mitigant. Uh, you have to do proper valuations before you, you invest in any uh, company. So we believe in every challenge there will be opportunities. And I don't think that uh, there will not be opportunity to invest in this market. To be honest, I think there are more opportunities now than in the, in the past. Uh, we, we've been lucky enough to find very good uh, companies at a very depressed valuation, and that really is helping us improving our returns.